Let me, let me go to both you, Ms. Sue, and, and Mr. Boudreaux. We're in kind of an interesting um, situation. The hearing's a little bit interesting because you're, you're basically kind of swapping places here, if you will. Um, uh, Mr. Boudreaux, your nomination to uh, Assistant Secretary for Policy Management and Budget, where Ms. Sue has been, uh, I don't think I'm making any news by saying that I have appreciated your leadership, Mr. Boudreaux, in so many of these issues that, that impact us, particularly up north. Uh, the leadership that you have, have clearly demonstrated on, on some, um, some policy issues that required uh, kind of paving some, some new ground up there as we look to explore in, and uh, produce in the Arctic. And the fact that you are moving to what I would consider to be more of a desk job in the sense that the focus is on uh, more of the administrative and, and the, the budget end of it, I've expressed my concerns to you that I don't want this to be moving backwards in any, in any way, not that I would suggest that focusing on the budget piece of it is not equally important, but I want, I want that assurance that you still remain engaged in the policy uh, level, the decision making that goes on and recognizing that, that within the department uh, and under this new secretary, there, there are different management styles. You've indicated that you think that this is a more um, uh, kind of a kitchen cabinet type of, of an approach to management. But it is important to me to know that uh, you will continue to, to be involved in so many of these initiatives where you have really led. And the Interagency Working Group on Alaska Energy is a very specific example of that where you bring together the high level officials to advance energy development, streamline the permitting process. Um, you, the, the leadership that you've demonstrated act, as the acting chair, I think, has, has been very important. So I'd, I'd like the assurance that you will remain committed um, to, to not only being part of this group, but, but remaining the chair of, of this group and, and continuing to lead on these policy initiatives that I think we all recognize are going to be very critical going forward. Yes, thank you for that, Senator Murkowski, and for the vote of confidence. Uh, as you know and, and we've discussed, I'm heavily invested in all of these issues, uh, resource issues, uh, the interplay with resource development, and uh, responsible conservation uh, at a landscape level. Uh, I believe uh, from the Assistant Secretary of Policy Management and Budget position, I can actually um, take a broader perspective on all of those issues and help us move forward uh, and build on the gains we've made so far as uh, both um, uh, a naturally situated coordinating role across all the bureaus in the department, uh, but also uh, to provide the benefit of uh, my experience and my counsel uh, to the secretary and to the deputy secretary and the other members of uh, the department in their leadership roles. Uh, I wouldn't be uh, interested in this position uh, unless I was able to carry forward with all of those issues. Uh, as you know, I'm pretty heavily invested in them, including the issues relating to uh, Alaska. Uh, with respect to the interagency working group, on permitting in Alaska. That is a tremendous innovation uh, that we've made there. I actually think it has broader application elsewhere in the country as well. That type of approach of bringing in the entire federal family as well as other stakeholders, local communities, uh, local tribes, uh, and other interests bringing them to the table to try to work through the difficult issues that are involved in coming up with the right answers and right solutions on permitting major, major projects. Uh, so again, I bring that perspective into this role and I'll carry it forward. I also expect to be uh, and to remain very visible, uh, very involved uh, on a host of issues related to Alaska, including continuing in a leadership role with the working group. Well, and I appreciate that. I, I will acknowledge that, that that does give me some comfort to know that not only your involvement on, on the Alaska oil and gas issues um, will, 
will be a, a prominent part of your responsibilities as Assistant Secretary for, for Policy Management and Budget, that you'll continue with a working group and, and continue to work as these regs are, are developed for oil and gas exploration in Alaska. I think um, it's important to have your leadership there, and I want it made very clear that I have that confidence in you. I think many do, and I don't want us to be going backwards um, at a time when we need to be making forward progress.